empanologist, and if I'm empanologist, I'm studying empanadas, empanology, um, it just kind of like popped out of that, that whole uh, little segment of thoughts. <laughs> So once I saw that happen, the next morning at 6 a.m., I just tapped on the, the website. And two nights after the fire, they contacted me and asked if I wanted to get involved with their relief efforts. So we picked up a little contract with them and we started feeding, feeding several hospitals. So we, we mixed it up a bit, being that uh, a lot of the, uh, the background from the families displaced were like West African. Um, we try to cook a lot of their meals. So we, Originally, we weren't doing empanadas. We were just doing like some bowls of rice with some of their chicken, some of their seafood, or some of their veggies. Part of who we are, we're from the Bronx, we're in the Bronx, and I think wherever this brand grows, we're gonna tap into the community and make sure we got the support. We wouldn't be here today as a brand if it wasn't for the support of the community anyways.